Hey guys, welcome to episode number 267. Today is Monday, so it's update Monday. And today I had one quick little thing to share with you guys. And that is the uh, marbled crayfish in this tank. Uh, if you go back to past videos, you will see that the single marbled crayfish in this aquarium uh, had a little bit of a bluish hue to the shell and that's pretty abnormal for a marbled crayfish. Uh, they're always brown in color. I've never seen any other colored marbled crayfish besides a brown one. Uh, but as you can see here, we have the remains of the molt of that marbled crayfish and you can definitely see blue coloration in that shell especially on the pieces of the claw uh, but you will note that the same crayfish that molted from this shell is hiding in this little coconut hide and uh, lo and behold when I picked this up the marbled crayfish that was underneath looked just like a normal marbled crayfish that's the exact coloration that it should be yet this is what its old shell looked like now I know when a marbled crayfish is about to molt uh, sometimes the color of the the shell can change a little bit but as you can see with both the molt and the crayfish in this picture it's quite a big difference and I'm a little perplexed as to why it could have gone from such a blue color back to such a normal color. I'm wondering if uh, I'll ever get that coloration back or if it was just some sort of fluke um, or if it was something that I fed it right after it molted the last time that caused it or something crazy like that. But anyways guys, that's the crayfish right there. Pretty normal looking to me. Um, We'll see if the coloration comes back or not, but uh, I'll also keep this one alone in this tank in case it does have babies. We'll see uh, if I get any weird stuff going on uh, with those as well. But anyways, guys, that's kind of a little oddity in the fish room today. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.